very early in the day, 8.30 typically, with um, what we call the text of the day. 30 minutes to look at a text in detail. This morning I got the press review. Uh, we heard the BBC radio. OK, uh, we're going to start by listening to the headlines of uh, the... Before coffee, they could have uh, a grammar lesson and a listening comprehension. They may be with an individual tutor or in small groups. The order and then decide who is going to I like the concept where the intensive uh, lesson with face-to-face, -face, grammar, uh, quatorial. Working with four people can talk to each other, and it, which is very important for me because I have a project with other countries and they are speaking English, but not native language. <laughs> Coffee time is an important um, timetabled event. It's very brief, but it does give uh, students the opportunity to chat to each other and discuss their programmes. We typically give them some time to work on their own um, at some point during the day. The most difficult part of their day would be their oral exam. It's out as an invasion of privacy. There is also the problem. We'll work on oral skills and presentation techniques for an hour or so. All okay. in the plural. Mm. All singular. All. After lunch the students will go back to their individual or group lessons and the day continues until half past five in the afternoon. Um, we'll give them two or three hours of homework a night to do as well. I'm very lucky here I've got such a good bank of teachers um, who teach different areas. Most of them have specialisations. But if you say something under your breath what would that suggest? Teachers are very professional, so they know Korean people's problem and French people's problem, so they can correct our problems. Tutorial course is really helpful. Uh, my teachers can focus on my interest that I want to learn. When they ask me what I would like to do, what I'm interested in, how I do different things, and the next day they come with articles, information, about that thing. They're working really hard, the students, while they're here, so we, but we do like to offer them uh, different ways of uh, relaxing and using their English in an authentic context. So we find that different nationalities meeting up together at uh, important times of the day, like the coffee break, lunchtime, and then on the activities that we offer, the cultural programme, makes a significant difference to their, uh, their stay with us. This school is a great opportunity to really improve English. The school keeps us busy, but I like the atmosphere here. You have no judgment, no bad regard. It's a good ambience and a positive attitude.